All right, so my, my name is Susan Rickman and I'm the CEO of World Pediatric Projects. So I've been with the organization since 2001 and coming to St. Vincent since 2001. So I feel like this is my second country here. And of course today we have our pediatric general surgery team coming into St. Vincent, Milton Cato with other countries filtering their children in and this team has been coming, uh, I would say for about the past 13, 14 years that we've had a general surgery team coming in. So it sounds like today we've got about 36 kids that we're seeing and we'll start the surgical week tomorrow and this team will be working all week. So the first time we came down after a really a Rotarian reached out to us to ask us if we would look at what our mission was to do that down in St. Vincent. So in 2001, we did a little site visit down here and then the rest is history. So we have, you know, almost 12 teams a year now coming into from the different subspecialties and even working on your neonatal care in your NICU uh, unit here at the hospital. Since about 2008, uh, when the Prime Minister here said it's time to open the doors to the rest of the Caribbean for children to come here to meet up with these subspecialty teams, we started including the St. Lucia's, the Antigua's, the Grenada, the Dominica, and really then developed the Eastern Caribbean initiative. So every time a team comes down, there will be children even coming for those islands because just like St. Vincent, while they've got doctors and they've got surgeons here on island, great doctors, they just don't have those pediatric subspecialists to treat on their children. So we've really now built this into a regional program with St. Vincent the Grenadines being that pediatric center of excellence for the Eastern Caribbean. So us at Rural Pediatric Project are extremely proud of this and as Every citizen of St. Vincent the Grenadines should be so proud that they're ground zero for pediatric critical care in the Caribbean.